What if I told you the Gripen's true power isn't just its stealth or agility, but a secret weapon hidden within its very core? We're diving deep into the Rolls-Royce engine that makes the Gripen an unparalleled force in NATO's arsenal. Prepare to discover the technological marvel that gives the West an insurmountable edge in the skies. Forget everything you thought you knew about air superiority. The Gripen isn't just another fighter jet. It's a game changer, all thanks to one specific piece of engineering. It's Rolls-Royce engine. This isn't just about raw power. It's about a strategic advantage so critical it's considered NATO's hidden ace. Find out why this engine is the ultimate secret weapon. Ever wondered what truly makes a fighter jet indispensable to a global alliance? It's not always the obvious. Join us as we dissect the Gripen's Rolls-Royce engine, a technological marvel so advanced it redefines air superiority for NATO. You're about to uncover the cutting-edge secrets behind its exceptional performance and strategic importance. Sleek, nimble, unstoppable. The Gripen zips across the sky like a phantom, leaving bigger jets in its wake. But behind every breathtaking maneuver lies a secret most pilots rarely talk about. The Gripen has earned a reputation as one of the most agile, cost-effective fighters in the world. Analysts call it versatile, reliable, even cunning in combat. But what truly makes it so effective isn't its airframe or even its software. There's an unsung hero powering every twist, climb, and evasive maneuver. A hidden force that transforms a standard fighter into a tactical marvel. And soon, we'll reveal exactly which powerhouse makes this possible. Before the Gripen could perform its astonishing maneuvers, it needed a heart. And that heart started life as the F-404 a combat-proven engine that powers the legendary F-A-18 Hornet. Rugged, reliable, and tested under some of the harshest conditions imaginable, the F-404 already had a reputation for toughness and performance. But Sweden didn't stop there. Engineers at Volvo Aero, now part of GKN Aerospace Engine Systems, took the F-404 and transformed it into something uniquely suited for the Gripen, the RM-12. This wasn't just an upgrade, it was a complete reinvention, tailored to a fighter that needed to be agile, versatile, and survive in environments others couldn't even attempt. The modifications are subtle but critical. An upgraded afterburner delivers more thrust on demand. Structural reinforcements enhance durability and reliability under extreme conditions. Every tweak, every enhancement, turns the RM-12 from a proven engine into a bespoke powerhouse. The secret force behind the Gripen's astonishing agility and operational flexibility. The Gripen's performance in the air is nothing short of extraordinary, and much of that comes from its powerhouse, the RM-12 engine. One of its most impressive feats is supercruising, the ability to maintain supersonic speeds without engaging afterburners. For pilots, this isn't just a fuel-saving trick, it's a tactical advantage. Staying supersonic without the afterburner reduces heat signature, preserves fuel, and allows the jet to strike or evade quietly, leaving heavier fighters struggling to catch up. But speed is just one part of the story. The RM-12's rapid thrust response makes the Gripen a master of short takeoff and landing operations. Unlike other modern fighters that require long, well-prepared runways, the Gripen can launch from roads, temporary strips, or icy Nordic airfields. In a real conflict, where large airbases are prime targets, this agility ensures the Gripen can stay in the fight even when traditional bases are compromised. It turns the aircraft into a mobile, elusive predator, a nightmare for adversaries trying to predict its movements. And there's another silent advantage, the RM-12's modular design. 
components can be swapped in field with minimal equipment, dramatically reducing maintenance downtime. This means higher sortie rates and more operational flexibility, a critical factor in sustained air campaigns. Combined with the engine's reliability and efficiency, the RM12 doesn't just power the Gripen, it underpins an entire strategy of dispersed operations, resilience, and cost-effective dominance. In short, the RM12 is not just an engine, it's the beating heart of a fighter designed to outlast, outmaneuver, and outperform. Beyond the impressive performance of a single aircraft, the RM-12 engine carries strategic implications that ripple across NATO's entire air strategy. One of its most understated advantages is interoperability. Because the RM-12 shares core design principles and maintenance protocols with other NATO-compatible engines, logistics and training are simplified. Pilots and ground crews can transition smoothly, spare parts are easier to manage, and operational readiness is higher all without sacrificing combat effectiveness. But the strategic value goes even deeper. The Gripen, powered by the RM-12, thrives in dispersed and austere conditions. It can launch from small airstrips, highways, or makeshift bases, the kind of flexibility that allows NATO to spread its air power across multiple locations. This distributed capability is a game-changer, increasing survivability in high-intensity conflicts and enabling the Alliance to maintain pressure on adversaries without relying on large, vulnerable airbases. Looking ahead, the RM-12 is a forward-looking asset. Its modular design, robust architecture, and potential for upgrades mean the Gripen fleet can evolve alongside emerging technologies, from improved digital controls to next-generation fuel systems and enhanced thrust capabilities. This inherent adaptability ensures NATO doesn't just maintain air superiority today, it sets the foundation for dominance well into the future. In essence, the RM-12 isn't just an engine for Sweden, it's a cornerstone of NATO's strategic flexibility and long-term operational resilience. The RM-12 engine does more than just push the Gripen through the sky, it powers the future of the aircraft itself. Integrated with cutting-edge sensor fusion, advanced avionics, and real-time battlefield awareness systems, the engine provides the reliability and efficiency that make these next-generation technologies fully effective. Without the RM-12, the Gripen wouldn't just lose speed, it would lose the very backbone of its operational intelligence. Looking ahead, the future of the RM-12 is just as intriguing. Engineers are exploring upgrades to increase thrust, improve efficiency, and integrate new materials and digital controls. Some concepts even hinted derivatives that could power other platforms, potentially setting new standards for fighter engines worldwide. This is not just evolution, it's a blueprint for how air power could adapt to future conflicts. So here's the question for you aviation enthusiasts. In a world where speed, flexibility, and digital integration are everything, could the future of air dominance depend more on the engine than the airframe itself? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Viper Jet Wings wants to hear what you think about the next generation of fighter engines.